From seizing up bearings to bearings at sea and charts of the fishing grounds off Heron Bay, these anglers think it funny that Tunney's a name everyone knows, while so few know of that other big game fish called Tope. Fishing for Tope calls for strong arms and nerves, and boats stout enough not to capsize when taking a strained broadside on. It's a sport which brings 100 expert fishermen to these waters every year, a quest which takes them eight miles offshore. Folk in these parts know Tope to be a dangerous fish, savage fighters, half dogfish, half shark. They swim in from the Mediterranean each spring to breed off our southeastern coasts. You couldn't pick a better than old Harry Shepard to show how to bait the four-inch hook. Mackerel or herring, that's what they like. Way ahead, there she blows. Arthur Fitz, an old hand at this game, it'll take a 60-pound jerk to break his line. But he'll need cunning as well as strength to play his fish and get his hook wedged home. It looks easy now she's alongside the boat, but that's only because her fury's spent. It'll take more than one man to heave her on board. She's a 50-pounder if she weighs on us. More and more fishermen are hunting tope. They say it's a game of fish than tunny. 25 quid can buy all the tackle they need. It's the ordinary bloke's big game fish. Now for the fish we watched out of Fitland. It's going to land him the second prize for the day. 49 pounds, 15 ounces of fish that didn't get away. But it'll get away with a lot of Arthur's cash if he wants it stuffed. 